Nauru is the central city of trading. Back when ships from Valencia would anchor in Nauru, children would greet the merchants and fireworks would light the skies. Nauru was a thriving city of sailors and merchants. And crowded areas were guarded by mercenaries. Little did they know what had arrived. Could any of these people know of the Elysian Stone? It is the mythical stone of the ancient civilization. But the dark power it possesses has been hidden by that very civilization. At last, the Elysian was uncovered. A mysterious black smoke rose up over the ridge. It seemed to know exactly where it was headed. To Gomanaru. The Elysian stone reverberated. People started to disappear all across Gomanaru. In the end, there was no one left, and that day was soon forgotten. I got this necklace in Medea when I was young. Maybe this necklace is the cause of my granddaughter's nightmares. If you really need it, I'd be happy to give it to you. That would be a great help. I'm too old to care about this kind of thing anymore, you know. <clears throat> Here you are. Oh, thank you so much. We'll do everything possible to find the source of your granddaughter's nightmares. Please. Seek out Princess Durette and her investigation team at the Ancient Stone Chamber. <clears throat> Are you really an expert? You don't look like one to me. I've investigated ruins across the continent. Ancient artifacts are my forte. Everybody says they're an expert. Could you have done all that by yourself? Not by myself. Yeah, I'm, not, not I'm with an ancient language what? expert yes, and some quality way. excavators. Ah. Uh. Hmm. Oh. Uh. You stand before Princess Jurette. You must mind your... Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Please understand that it's hard to trust you given the magnitude of the task before us. Return where you came from. Hmm. All right then. This gemstone was recovered from the Valencia ruins. It was verified to be authentic by the Imperial Court. It couldn't be. A gem of balance? They say it concealed the dark power, but I never thought I'd see one in my life. Could this be what Sir Jordine is looking for? Fine. You are in charge of the hmm. Stone Chamber investigation. A fortnight. That's how long you'll have for the investigation. Good. You'll see me sooner than that. <laughs> Who the hell is Commander Croxus, anyway? Did he get promoted to Commander by breaking bottles? <laughs> Isn't this 
Just an excuse to drink more? Hm. Trust me, he, he told me there's another imp captain. T -t Tiny Nose told me. Where is he? Uh, uh, a cave. The, the imp cave. The search party? On standby. So it's in the northeast. You will go with him. Yes. Uh, if there's two imp leaders, this won't be easy. This tastes weird. Do you expect me to eat this garbage? Princess, this isn't Heidel, you know. Uh, I don't want to hear it. Let's just finish here and go home. Eden, look at this. Is something wrong with the artifact? Could it somehow be your presence? You, though it's weak, you are possessed with dark energy. It still hasn't awakened. Hey, tell us anything at all you can remember about the black energy. You must rid yourself of all those hallucinations. Eden, stop. He seems unstable. Esoteric. Alchemy begins with understanding the fundamental principles of all things. All things exist based on... Huh? What's happening? The staff is shaking! The device reacts when black energy is present. My friends, do not be afraid. It's a small amount of energy. Is a stranger among us by any chance? Some beetle wings, parasitic bee lava sauce, and after that, insert a drop of imp's tears and then... Oh. Oh. This happens every single time I try to make rouge. Oh! Oh, uh, welcome! Idol, Serendia's capital. Year 277 of the Elionian calendar, Serendia was declared a tributary state after Calpheon's invasion. Calpheon's Xeon alliance attained commercial supremacy in Serendia and dominated trade in Heidel. King Crucio de Mangat, who was taken hostage after the war, returned to Heidel. However, he was reduced to a feudal lord and completely lost his political will. Grand Chamberlain Jordan Ducasse became the de facto leader and his influence soared. This. Be on your way. Mm. Bobby Lauren, you wasted my time the last time. Your pain is overdue. My conscience is clear. Whatever happens to you, just wait and see. When I exact my price, I'll make you rue the day you were born. The grace will repay you soon, I told you. Trying to trick me again. It's simple. Give me commercial authority. Hobios will have you. Oh. God. Useless fool. Isabel may have figured things out already. Don't worry. Without any concrete evidence, the blame will be pinned on Bobby Lauren. They'll uncover what we have planned. We'll form an army of soldiers from Medea. Their movements will look like common trade activity. I feel. 
year. This will bring the fall of Serendia as a nation. My lord, Serendia is already Calfian's pawn. The Calfian eagle has sunk its talons into the lion's heart. I will be the lion and send the eagle back at last. The one known as the Monarch of Darkness is Belmorn, the founder of the Shadow Knight. Your power alone is not enough to deal with him. Eden went to Glish with the Liston to seek the advice of the chief there. They're researching any means to prevent Balmorn's resurrection. I heard Gorgaths in Calfion. He's working to purify the spreading darkness there. Then I'd better go see what he has to say about all of this. Oh, barbecue. Savory. Please take care of Yaz. No! Give me more! Oh. Hold on. I'll go to Kalfian instead. I'd rather deal with the Monarch of Darkness. <laughs> That's exactly what Eden said. Kalfian uh, huh? scum aren't permitted here. Leave. What'd that jackass just say? Did you hear a cat screeching somewhere? You rat. How dare you? Hunt. Huh? Lower your voice. We have guests. Tell them to come again later. We'll be here every day until you repay Bobby Lauren's debt. You heard the lady. Get lost. <laughs> Hunt, is it? Listen up. The Lady Isabel's patience has worn thin. It's an ill omen. Alejandro said I was urgently needed. I never imagined I'd find servants of darkness here. Listen. On this land, Monarch of Darkness will rise again. That's what it said. It says the Sealed Master is here. It couldn't be. And yet... Do you know something? No, but I'm sure the Chief of Glish... He'll have some insight on this. I'd better go speak with Freharau. believe everyone's on your side? Who would have imagined one of your followers would poison the well? It can't be. You still don't understand, my old friend? Why do you think I was able to waltz in here unhindered? They must have been taken in my own Sir Joaquin, Dawson from the 
this extraction mill has requested you grace him with a visit. You must know he's trying to cover up for his disgrace. What do you speak of? Sometimes you talk in riddles. Bring the sword. This Shadow Knight's sword was found at the extraction mill. It was found at Dawson's lodging. His maid discovered it when she was cleaning. He made some kind of pact with the Shadow Knights. We simply must determine what Dawson is planning. I will meet with him. Prepare my horse. This forest is foreboding. I want to be away from this hole as soon as possible. It's been a long time, Sir Dawson. The look on your face tells me you're not doing so well. On the contrary, I'm comfortable anywhere on Calfian's land. But why carry around such an awful sword, Sir Jordine? That you would ask that question is surprising. You should know this sword better than I, shouldn't you? There's been a misunderstanding. I think you'll see what I mean after you read this. Please know that you can trust me. signed this indictment himself. I'm sorry that this turn of events has been a shock to you. The Lord has deserted me. <laughs> no, no way. I won't stand for this. It's no use. It would be best now to focus on maintaining your dignity, Sir Jordine. But maybe that's too much to expect from a traitor. Quick walking! Detain him! Sir Dawson, you're wrong to call me a failure. This land will be blind. All of it, from sea to sea. Of course, Calvin, no exception. that down for a minute while we chat. There. It's drinking water for Glish. We're bringing it in from high. I've heard the water's contaminated. I bet it's the Mudsters. Everything's gone to hell since Chief Donna disappeared. Can't you do something about it? You're the only one from our town who has any sway here. Ah, well, it's hard enough keeping the peace here in Heidel. I've got my hands full as it is. Anyway, the least I can do is speak with Instructor Crewhorn. I don't know what Donat was after. He must have had a reason for bringing ruin to the entire village. What's clear is this has nothing to do with alchemy. There must be some clues left in this wake. My deputies have already searched here. The device was broken before we came. But didn't you say you were good at these things? Now would be the perfect time to show off your talent, you know. Wait a second.
I finally have the key. At last, the preparations are complete. Donut, you have no idea what could be in that chest. Give up your false beliefs. You are a pitiful wretch. With this key alone, the whole world will be mine to shape as I please. You're not thinking straight right now. That is where you're wrong. Be gone. Don't try to stop me. <laughs> Behold! This power will save us all! Nago suddenly went berserk after seeing the artifact. Hey, pull yourself together. Damn it. Words are no use. cannot be saved with the likes of that artifact. Its power is that of destruction, not of salvation. Disguised himself to take part in the ritual. Jordan seemed out of his mind. The chalice of blending is filled to the brim with souls. Our Lord will come to us through this man. Nonsense! A spy! 
Stop him! Though the chalice of blending was broken, Jordan's soul lusted for revenge and flowed to Belmore. He was injured in grave danger. Fortunately, just saved him. The incomplete ritual did not fully resurrect Belmore, but the Shadow Knights pledged loyalty to him. Still, on the other side of darkness's threshold, for now you must follow me. First, I will raise an army. We thank you for your devotion to the Delph Knights. May Elian's blessings go with you. No! The orders mustn't be disclosed! Jordine. Your castle is a mess. Your soldiers are being slaughtered. Captain Pico. Sorry I didn't warn you. It's a surprise seeing you here. What? Is training harpies your new hobby? Wrong again. I have much more powerful allies. You're in league with the likes of them? That sinister energy was you all along. Indeed. There's no end to your Insight. But you're right. They pledge to follow only me. And as king of the Shadow Army, I now declare war on the Great Republic of Calpheon. The Harpy attacks are but a prelude to my revenge. My next move will be to destroy every single fortress in this document, one by one. Pull yourself together, Jordine. How long do you think they'll actually remain loyal to you? That is none of your concern, Captain Brago. Go tell that fossil the Parliament. I, Jordine, am coming to burn everything Calpheon has. The ashes of decay. The wheat has been loaded into the wagon, ma'am. Then leave for the refugee camp. Stop right there. Oh. Mrs. Light, I already told you. The arms must be blessed by Elion first. I understand your concerns, good priest, but the people are starving. Ordinary food will do nothing to save them, I told you. Don't you get it? Can't you see the refugees are suffering for their own sins? The pharmacist claims differently. He says the contagion will spread faster if they're starving. Fortunately, we've harvested enough wheat this year to be able to do something to help alleviate their hunger. Hmm. If you deny God's will, your farm won't be spared from punishment. Really? Is that truly God's will? Are you really so confident that you're willing to test the wrath of Elion? Your arrogance will bring disaster to this farm. You hear me? These beggars are relentless. Back off. The priest wants to talk. Lord Elion is well aware that you are all in pain. Help. It's so painful. Help. Please save us. However, have you ever even considered why Lord Elion hasn't offered you his aid? Every last one of you has sinned, and you are yet to be forgiven. Were people who followed the priest the other day saved? Hmm. It seems you haven't fully committed to giving up a life of sin. With that kind of attitude, you cannot be saved. Other than this one here, those willing to repent may get in the wagon. I believe! I have faith! Take me! Let me go! Take, Take me! me! Take me! So you're not a coward to have come all the way here. Sid, I don't have the energy to look up at you. The one who emerged from the Watchtower's coffin. His name is Belmore. Some call him the Monarch of Darkness. 
His resurrection ritual is incomplete, so he hasn't obtained true form. But his power will continue to grow, and his dream of bathing the entire world in darkness will soon be accomplished. We came to guard this place. You've heard of the group protecting the world from dangerous secrets? The secret guards? We're part of it. It's true. Now you know exactly who we are. The power dwelling within you is a darkness no different from the evil of Belmore. said something, right? You still have a chance to rectify this crisis and cleanse your own soul for good. But Belmorn, Belmorn is clearly after you. Your power is the same, but he will try to stamp yours out. There's a huge farm to the west. Orwin has gone there. Belmorn is a fierce opponent. You should go help her out. Have you been well, Gorgas? You have servants of darkness in your midst. It's been a while, Orwin. It's a troubling issue. Those devils truly seem to be everywhere these days. I see. I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but the monarch of darkness has returned. That's terrible. Purifying darkness with sunrise herbs alone won't be sufficient anymore. I have some old friends at the Holy College. I'll ask them for advice. It seems you were quick to sense the danger. Is there no way to stop the Lord of the Dark? We'll have to come up with something. Gorgoth, someone's watching us. It seems we've attracted attention in spite of our efforts. We have little time. Owen, why don't you see what's happening at the refugee camp? Then join Gorgoth at the Holy College. Dweller's demonstration is growing. This movement is destined to shake the very foundations of Calfiel. The Trina Knights stand ready to put every last one of them down at a moment's notice. The citizens will only become more agitated if we dispatch the military to the streets. They long for equal tax rate. We mustn't give in to their demands. If we bend for them this time, they'll only become much more brazen in the future. I'm more concerned about what the Bayesian family's soldiers and those pirates are doing in the slum. Are you suggesting that they have some sort of connection? That's not exactly what I said. But isn't somebody stirring up the citizens' ire? Perhaps it's because the people of the slum are turning their backs on alienism. Watch your mouth, Dominic. You think I'm trying to push them out of the city for the lack of faith? Stop this, now. This is no place for petty quarreling. There is no doubt the pirates in the slum are concerning, but unforeseen problems can admittedly arise in such chaotic circumstances. I think that's enough for this session. The 
refugee camp was a complete mess. Jordine, no Balmorn, was converting the sick into his followers. He aims to increase his power by expanding the forces of darkness. Jordine's will won't stand up to Belmorn much longer. He'll soon succumb to the Monarch of Darkness. Belmorn, His power is darkness. If we are to beat him, we need a counterforce. Light. There was an undying light protecting humanity in ancient times. This light was released by the origins of clear water, earth, and crimson flame. But humanity was overcome by greed. Ultimately, the world was left to face the calamities of darkness on its own. Yet, it is said that noble light can be awakened again by the Guardian of Origin. Elionian priests refer to what you speak of as the Light of Elion. It sounds like superstition. Some kind of folk legend. But there's always truth in ancient myths, isn't there? I made a solemn oath never to wake it in my lifetime. La Luate Satera Harima. Human, did you forget your oath to me? Origin of Crimson Flame. The dark power casts its shadow across the world. We need your power to restore that undying light humans have been so long without. Humans brought the darkness upon themselves. However, I cannot deny you've been forsaken by the light for a long time. Awaken the origins of clear water and earth. Should you overcome this crisis and unite me with them, I swear before the Guardian of Origin that the noble light will illuminate your darkest hour. You... you are the... the Guardian of Ancient Origin the whole time. I've been standing guard here awaiting such a crisis. Orwin, it's time for you to go to Florin. Seek out a small cave beneath the town. Find Kafras there. He's done much research on the origin of clear water. Let Eden handle the origin of Earth. We'll meet up in Keplin afterward. I understand. I'll find the one named Kafras no matter what. I heard a terrible infectious disease is spreading throughout southern Keplin. That will be our next destination. Let's meet with Eden when Orwin comes back. The Guardian of Ancient Origin is... Oh? It's never easy tracking you down, Martha. You used to have no problem finding me. I'm losing my edge. Anyway, I need your help. You may know already, but the dark power grows ever stronger. I heard a great war has broken out. Is it Balmoran's resurrection? Indeed. According to Alustin, the ancient light is our last hope. It would seem you're speaking of the undying light thought only to exist in legend. I am, and I need your help. Of course. I'll begin by looking for any trace. Martha! Martha! Huh? Huh? Monster in the excavation site! Oh my god. I've never been this deep before either. Even the bravest souls have no interest in coming this far below. Kalfras was the only one who liked this place. Jordine? I am not Jordine. Jordine, remember who you are. Your idol is Grand Chamberlain. What nonsense. Serendia is a bit. I have a sheep in the of the darkness. I will annihilate this world. Yes, vengeance awaits. Tear up your soul and deliver it to the eternal.
He will stand by my side every day, trembling with fear and horror. <laughs> Why did you do that? Surely you haven't come all this way for some idle chatter. You and I meet at the worst times. I need your help. I heard already. The origin of Earth, right? You're in luck. It's right here. I was investigating these ruins and here it was. The trial Alliston mentioned. It must have been the trouble I had coming to meet you. Do you know how to awaken the origin of Earth to insert this? Of course. However, I'm worried you might be injured in the process. Surely the origin of Earth won't let you off without some kind of test. I bet your test was much worse. Okay, okay, stand in the center and chant the spell. What test? What are you talking about? It's nothing. It's gonna be dangerous here. Go down, yes. Fine. Chant. Nazda. Erahima. Komatan. Karate. You can do this. Nazda. Rahima, Kometa, Karate. had nothing on your test. Their failure to withstand the power of light left them like this. You have a choice. I can leave you here in the state of eternal agony, or you can agree to help me. Human, the fulfillment of your final wish is nigh. Yes, it is time. Those infernal Californian scum will meet their end here. <laughs> you are mistaken. What do you mean? If we destroy this place, the Californian troops will be doomed. 
and I will finally be king. <laughs> Ignorant fool, I will make you a king. The king of worms, that is. <laughs> so you are absorbing other human souls, waiting for the chance to take possession of my body? Your soul was full of the purest form of anger, you know. That's why I selected you. But now, it is broken and reeks of imperfection. Ugh, I'll get you in the end, Belmorn. Kenarek, Kentry, Panoa. Oh, 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 oh. Must have come in or instead. So she has met an ill fate. So much has been sacrificed for our cause. You too are fated to play a critical role in the events of this era. You have my gratitude. You've accomplished a great task. We simply cannot thank you enough. Let us begin the ritual. La. Luhate, Satare, Hariba! I couldn't have been easier to convince them that you've made it. We are settling your will in faith. As promised, we will lend you the grace of the noble light. Against 
against my will. I can't withstand it much longer. Use the necklace Eden gave. With the power of Idana's necklace, you can expel Belmorn in his weakened state. Ugh. Vicious little witch. If you use it, this mortal soul shall plummet into the darkness with me. Do you truly wish to sentence her soul to eternal darkness? <laughs> Hurry. The artifact. in his wake. You might detest me, but I'll never apologize. I don't consider anything I've done to be a mistake, and I'm far from done yet. Victory will be mine. I told Dibs! Give it here, it's mine! This is goodbye. I only survived back there because of you. I'm truly thankful. Thanks to you, we foiled the plans of Belmont. Georgian may have gotten away, but he's been severely weakened, and it should be safe here for now. I nearly forgot this. <laughs> you keep it. It's yours. The past does not dictate the future. From now on, you're free to make your own decisions. We're heading to Medea. There's word among the secret gods. Something is afoot there. It's about to leave! Hurry up! Well, we must go. It truly was a blessing of the gods to have met you. Fake conspires down the road will come to meet again. <laughs> so long! Come visit us! See you around! Be well!